One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Be that boy, Lane Leasy. JC the Light. And we here to Set the Tone Podcast. You know, today we got an exceptional guest, Morning Star. Hey, six, y'all. six, six. Morning, Morning Star, six, Star. six. <laughs> Came through to set the tone with us today. How you feeling? I'm good. Good? Feeling good. This liquor got me feeling a little <laughs> spicy a little bit. <laughs> Caso. Okay. You know what I'm saying? For the people who might not know, you know what I mean? Morning Star. Morning Star about what does Morning Star do? Where you from? Um, I'm originally I was raised in Texas. Overall? Okay. Yeah. So I'm actually from Texas, but I've been living in New York for about six years. I bartend, model, video model, host, a little bit of everything. What bring you to New York? I mean, yeah, how was you it from- to do that? Like, was it school? I was, was it, uh, no, no. I went well, I went to school in Texas. I went to college in Texas. Oh, okay. Um, um, t- Texas Southern University. Um, but I was cost me a few spreads that team right there. <laughs> yeah, all right, go ahead. Mm-hmm. But I was working as a personal assistant in California, and they moved me here. So I oh. I was moved here, and then I started bartending after knowing Tina. Tina. Tina Colada. Oh, okay, yeah. okay, okay, okay. She got me to bartend. She got mm-hmm. you into. So it wasn't something you were. No, 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 no. Nah, she was already really bartending. I met her through bartending. Oh, okay. We go into her bar, and then she got me to bartend. Oh, okay. She was okay, like, you okay. know, you got the looks. You got the, yeah. <laughs> you got the eyebrows. Okay. <laughs> she said, nah, she's the one. So yeah. how you feel about it? How how you embrace it? I mean, well, six years in. Yeah, bar- bartending is fun. I mean, the strip clubs in New York is a lot different coming from the South. Mm. You know what I mean? Like, mm-hmm. actually having bartenders um, present it present it more than like the main dancers and stuff like that so yeah. it was it's a big difference but um after getting in it it's it's fun i loved it mm-hmm. i loved it did, did it take much convincing no i like the strip clubs okay. so okay. <laughs> what, what about the strip clubs do you like besides um, the bread of course of course um, of course it's fun you can be yourself you know what I mean? Like compared to regular clubs and strip clubs, strip clubs, you can be yourself. People are actually dancing mm-hmm. in the clubs. You're just in your section. You know what oh, I mean? Yeah, like yeah. you can't just, move, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you don't yeah, move. Yeah, yeah. And then even when you're a pretty girl, you don't move out your section. section yeah. You know, so. Because niggas is cuffing, that's why. Cuffing <laughs> or niggas is just with their the guys in the, you know, in the yeah. se- people with money really don't move out. Yeah, <laughs> of where you're going, of where your spot is, you know. So, how's that look to you, to you, especially as a bartender, when um, you know, the section is thirty deep, three women. That's um, it. it looks kind of like maybe like, five of them. The numbers are a little a girl. Off. Maybe it's, <laughs> each girl is five niggas. You never know. Yeah. I, don't, I don't look at it. I don't look at it as anything. I just hope then these. I hope all these niggas busting a bag. That's often though, wouldn't you not say? No. <laughs> no. Nah? No. So you see, you see, there's, you a, see there's a some times where it's a lot of guys and it's only three guys in that thirty that's really busting a bag. No, no, I'm not. What's not a that bag? Part. Let's I'm get to that. Part. I'm talking about the part. What is called busting a bag? I'm not even I like talking about that. But yeah, let's talk. Let's think about that. I like that right there. What's the so, limit? Like, what do you call busting a bag? Um, depending on the people, how many people <laughs> that's in the if section? It's, I, if it's or twelve people. Twelve people. Twelve in people. How many bottles you should see coming through? You came about no bottles. It's about the dollars going oh, out, oh, yeah, right? We talking strip clubs. Set. Twelve All people. Right. I mean, you hope to at least make about ten thousand. <laughs> Twelve mm. people at the bar. Yeah, all these people. <laughs> you know what I said? Like, like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, that is you. like. So that means every nigga yeah. should have a rack. Yeah, at least. 50. Why are you coming to the strip club and you're not even thinking about spending no money? Because this is just a dreamer. He wants to see and just, <laughs> just chill, true. listen to but trap music. Some dudes might. It, it might be different type of money. A guy might be like, "Yeah, I came to spend a couple hundreds. You know, maybe I had three hundred in my pocket." That I flipped to something. I mean, if that's what you can afford, then okay, cool. But so busting the bag is ten G's for twelve. A group of twelve. A group of twelve. Yeah, I mean, you should at least be able to make something. I mean, at the at least you should be able to make that. I've been at the bar, right? I've done bar prices, right? Like to get two bottles, like a special or something like that, whatever. Yeah. Right? <laughs> and niggas have removed me for niggas that was doing Coronas, and and I'm like, yo, how I'm moving from my seat for niggas that are doing beers and all that. How was that? They probably regulars. 
I don't know. I've never moved anyone for beers. I mean, unless they, it was some guy. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm dragging. I'm, <laughs> like, I'm dragging. But it's like, yeah. if I'm getting moved, like, it should be a movement, right? Mm -hmm. That's a fact. Um, so you have, do, do you have clients, customers that come like, yo, I'm only going just for her? Yeah. That's what you, I mean, that's what bartending is about. Mm -hmm. You have to have customers. In order to clientele. even have the job, you have to have clientele or customers to, that's going to come for you. You know, that's going to come and spin bottles, which that's what makes the club. Okay. Mm. You know. So your networking skills is up. Yeah. Is there a little bartender beef? But that. Behind the ball. It has to be. Because the couple before, girls now four, feeling three, me. Four years ago, you know the strippers I mean? was up. Now yeah. the strippers want to beat them up. <laughs> the strippers want to scrap. <laughs> These girls come there pretty with dreads. Like she's yeah. poetic justice. <laughs> poetic justice. Know what I'm saying? Coming through. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And they're like, yo, where's my bread? It's going to the girls not even barely dancing. I don't really, uh -huh. I don't really have beef with any dancers. But that's because, I mean, they, they like, you know, they like me. But a lot of dancers probably, or strippers, you know, they have, the only ones that have issues are the ones that's not willing to work. You know, mm -hmm. or is not willing to also have the same clientele or get cool with some bartenders mm -hmm. and, you know, just understand how it's supposed to be, you know. There's a lot of that, oh, there's that a lot my of guy, that's my dude. No, there's a lot of dancers that. that think that people are just supposed to spend money just because you're right there. True. Just you're, you're standing, you don't, they're not doing the work though. They're you're just not doing the work. There. You're not. You're yeah. not coming to talk to the guy, mm -hmm. even if he's my customer. For me, you're, uh, some girls are not even coming to talk to my customer. You're like, hey, let's have a shot. Let's have a drink. You're just coming and saying, slapping your ass, and think that a, a guy is supposed to turn around and he's spend like, money nah. on you. Yeah. Like, nah, when because he, this uh, shot he, ain't even Patron. This shit is water, not <laughs> yeah, the Monty yeah, yeah. niggas. You know yeah, what I'm saying? I don't know. I don't know. Nah, y'all y'all be doing. And and behind the bar, like say like I you do. Get five hundred, get five hundred in singles. You know, one time I just, I ain't gonna say some bird shit. I said, yo, this don't feel like a hundred dollars, man. It's What's not. going on in here? Definitely short a few. That has nothing to do with bartenders. What do you mean? Y'all giving don't the break? That. Nah, but they take they get that, that from somewhere else. Us. They get that from somewhere else. We get the we get the singles from behind from the, the back. back. Yeah, yeah, they get it from the back. Then never, by the time I'm not, you I'm not get falling it, for that. Th that has nothing. First to of all, do you're always us. getting but, ninety singles. Yeah, but any each hundred any club. Any club, anywhere, anywhere in the south, whatever they tax out of your singles, so mm -hmm. it's always going to be five to ten dollars short. Yeah. So when a guy kind of complains about that, it's like, come on, come on. You really, you really <laughs> so now, so now, now, now I know you're about to throw <laughs> this shit, and you want you me to beat the meat? But I want, I want my legacy to last. Long. How about legacy go last for eighty-eight dollars, my nigga? Well, like, come nah, on. but you beat him. First of all, you gonna your legacy is about to be terminated by asking about five to ten dollars. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You shouldn't saying. even be here if you about to be for me for that ten dollars. Nah, like get him out of here. Yeah. I'm an old school <laughs> nigga. Yeah. So now, now I know I'm a bird now. Like, yo, what's this, yo? It's eighty seven. Yeah. yeah. What happened? And the girl's yeah. like, I don't know. What I don't going know. On? I don't know. I'm like, oh my god. I don't know. <laughs> they already know not to even ask you if you want a bottle with this. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you move it. You know what I'm saying? Yo, you know yo, what old what generation nigga will never get no respect, son. So, so with with what you do, how is um you know the pandemic? dealing with you um well lately i've just been hosting oh, okay you know um i mean i also do a few things on the side um i've been also <clears throat> no no, <laughs> no. <clears throat> it's actually pretty only cool fans? What, what, no 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 no, no, no. <laughs> no only fans i've actually been working at a funeral home okay mm. Um, I've so you been set the niggas up, get the niggas killed, then well, I'll do your no, 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 no. What? No, no, no. I just yeah. do makeup. I just do makeup. Uh, okay. Oh, I just do makeup. Wow. Yeah. Real makeup artist, yeah. Oh, well, I, I was respectable. So you never yeah. did Mac or none of these Sephora shits. And no, like, and that's crazy. Yeah, I don't even do my own makeup. Level. I get my makeup done everywhere I go. Oh, wow. So, so what got makeup. you into that? <laughs> what, what even opened that? <laughs> so <you're> like, <laughs> <laughs> so this nigga's a makeup artist. And when it's time to get her makeup done, she's like, you know what? Yo, 8 o'clock. That's, That's a fact. It. But Respectable. let me tell you how I got in it. So um, a customer of mine that always comes to my bar, a really mm -hmm. nice guy and everything, um, he always comes to my bar at Starlet's. Um, okay. Actually, since he's been a customer of mine since um, Angels, oh, after Angel? Aces closed okay. and oh. Angels. And so he'll always come. So since we were closed, he texted me. He was like, you know, I know that you're not working. 
um, in the funeral business, it really sped up during the yeah. pandemic and oh, stuff yeah. like that. And he yeah. was like, you know, um, I have, I need a few extra workers. If you want to come try it out and see how, you know, if you can do it, then come. So after a while, I was like, you know what? I'm not doing shit. I'm just sitting in the house. Try it out. So, you all hip- <laughs> so how was your first like dead person makeup? It was actually pretty good. You didn't bother you or nothing. Like you cold hearted. No. <laughs> you cold blooded, son. No, you know what? Like I'm really spiritual and I'm all about energy and everything like that. So um it, what, it didn't really, what energy did the nigga have? The nigga's like this. Yes. No, you well, it was a it was a woman. And <laughs> okay. um I kind of looked at it as like, you know, this lady is kind of is trying, you know, I'm I'm doing makeup on this woman. For her relative is going to see, this is their last time seeing her. So right. it was more on a positive thing than thinking of anything, mm. you know? You know why? Because you're from down south. You're from Texas. That's why. Yeah, my family's New in York the church slimy, business and all son. that. So New York is slimy, son. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's what that's it is. Because you come yeah, New York is New York is really, really it crazy. <laughs> New, York, New Yorkers always, I say this all the time, like, New Yorkers always have an ulterior motive like so a lot of them like yeah. you always have to like like let me see if i really like you or mm. what you want you really <laughs> men you and women you yeah want. yeah you got to second guess everything in new york city yeah you have to with everyone even if it's good you be like with what, everyone what everyone want? can always tell that i'm really not from new york everyone they're like you're way too nice are, are you, you in the city um i live in brooklyn now oh, you're in brooklyn. Oh, okay yeah, but when i first moved to new york i was in the city yeah and still, everyone's like, you're not from here. You when I tell. first moved to New York, I'm sitting there speaking to people on the elevator. Like, yeah, why are you talking nah, to me? Like, yo, we <laughs> not doing it. Like, yo, 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 you know this, yo. Yo. You know her son, yo. Just keep, think, it's like say hi said, every day. I don't know what's going on. It's like you said, we automatically thinking yeah. you on something. Like, nah, she the boys or something? Like, mm-hmm. what's up with her? Asking all these questions. All, all <laughs> Star Weekend just passed in Atlanta. Was you a host? Yeah. How was that? It was fun. So you still have your, your jewels on. I'm, I'm yes, for yeah, yeah, no, it works. A, a lot of people, a lot of people went Some there. Some people don't care if male, female, and it came back in the negative. Going down. No, it Atlanta loves me and my friends, and we're always good in Atlanta. So, mm. um, we had a great time. We hosted at Chic three mm-hmm. nights in a row. Chic is really, really fun. It's a um, good club in after hours, and we also hosted at Allure. Okay. Which is kind of like the same owners. Allure is a strip club, mm-hmm. so it was, it was a lot of going on. Yeah, it a was lot. a whole the, lot. The, the basketball players weren't allowed to go anywhere though. Like, right? no, I, I think that changed. That changed the atmosphere. It never. did. No, if if it the basketball, it did it. no, because what? They, they, cause there's trap niggas that want to be well, like, yeah, nah. but imagine the trap niggas with James Harden and them when they pull up yeah, and like, do what if they do. The basketball you know players saying? were able to actually be there. Mm-hmm. Also, would have been. Amazing! It well, would have been saying, fun because you, you know a little, everyone you could drop a little sun. But you did you see a basketball player just no, running around the way he no, should we, have we, been? We, we, we not going to do that to the We not going to do that to the nigga. We ain't going to Lou Williams and shit. We ain't going to Lou Williams and shit at all. Nigga, Lou Williams got the wing spot. Like yo, like oh, fam, what you doing here? He's like. I ain't make the All Star game. I can fuck with this shit. Yeah, we we ain't going to do that. But that's what's up though. That's what's up. Yeah, now she we, doing she doing right. She we we're not gonna do that to them. She's back and forth. But I heard a lot of there was a lot of bad stories in the A. I wasn't around those no, parts. No, but. Of course not. No, no, no. I mean, not the spots like daytime. Like niggas getting their daytime wheels action. taken. Niggas is getting their charges. It was, it was no. It was stuff going on like that. No, let me tell you something. Actually, one time in front of our hotel, we was leaving out to go eat at Hyde, and um. It was Matt Cops. It's a Chick Fil A that was right next to our hotel. Mm-hmm. So when we walked out, we was like, "What the fuck's going on?" These guys were like, "These niggas tried to rob Chick Fil A," <laughs> and we were like, "Chick Fil A." What the what? Out of all places, what the hell is going on? dead ass, dead and serious. It was from I mean, dead serious, and it was a lot of it was a few area. guys that was sitting on on the curb, and they were going to jail. Oh, they caught them. Oh, they risked yeah. their life for the yeah, fillet. Caught what them. the dudes doing that? Yeah, they caught them. Crazy, crazy, and then um, there was a club that um, there was a club that some, someone got shot. Um, that I know of. it was it was it was a lot of it was a lot of sh- shootings that you would hear around. But with Atlanta, this club still goes on. In, in 
Yeah, the, yeah, during All Star. Yeah, so niggas, but, no, the thing, the, what the, the crazy no, thing is, no, gonna stop. No, niggas no, no, no. Let me tell like, you, you know what? No, the line, we still party. Let me tell you the difference from New York and Atlanta clubs. If you have a shooting in New York, mm-hmm. in front of the club, even around the club, the club is shut for good. Good. It's changed. You might still change the name, everything like you gotta that. Got to wait like yeah. two years. In Atlanta, yourself, like the club is the shooting. The club may still go on that night. That party's still going. <laughs> that on. night or tomorrow, they're they're still hosting and, and saying, "Hey, club," That's and it's still fire. going I, when on. I, when I was out there with, with Biggs and them and Ross and them, it, it, it was or Velvet Room, I think it was. Yeah, it was I don't clap. know. I, niggas, honestly, I've never been niggas, to A. Niggas, it's niggas fun was, though. Nah, it's fun. Niggas was niggas clapping in there, but you got one thing about the A, you got to move militant, like. Yeah, you, you do need to move in, in with the right. You, you can't be goofy. Ten, if you move in goofy, deep, then you... Ten go. deep. No, not you even necessarily deep. ten deep, you but be too security. Deep, but just be on point. Security, yeah, be on point. Yeah. Moving goofy is that, you know... Because they can carry. But yeah. Not, but how you carry if you're not if you not from the A? How do you... No, but you, you got to tap in. You got to tap in. Now, I even want to know. Like, I'm first saying, all, like, niggas probably a, never see me in there. Or, or just pay for security. First of all. That has, that's, yeah. that's able to carry. True shit. Because to be honest, to be honest, <laughs> nah, but to be honest, if you're moving out of town, if you're out and about out, anywhere out of town, you have, not to say tap in like extortion team, but like you got to tap even in. Even as somebody. girls, we get security you know I mean? every time. Really? That's We get security every time we out there. Every time. Every security, time we get security, makeup we have artists, driver. everything. Keep going. Security, driver, makeup artist. All right. Stylist. I'm convinced. Stylist. Hair I'm stylist. Convinced. Neiman Marcus. Right? I'm convinced this is the evolution of the woman. It is. And, 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 and unfortunately. Mm-hmm. She just said driver, security. Yeah. And our driver stays with us till we go back in 6 a.m. What's his invoice like? Back in the day, that guy. <laughs> you are <laughs> like what? back in the day, it would have been a sucker. Like my nigga, you out here driving yeah. for five hours, you ain't touching none of them. What are we doing? What my nigga? we do? But that's crazy. That's crazy. His invoice must be lit to be yeah. doing all that. But like I said, it's the evolution of the woman because women are bossing up. They, they could boss up, they but bad. they still got to stay in a place, my nigga. Ooh. I'm going to yeah, continue on. Nah, don't be, don't be scared. Scared niggas with a drink. Scared niggas with a drink. Nah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, come on. What I mean, you mean like staying in place? What you mean? Yeah, that's The man is supposed to lead, right? Allegedly, right? From yeah, I don't, I don't like that. So yeah, I'm not a person that gets out of my place and talk to men crazy like that. That's what I have security mm-hmm. for, or my man. Mm. So wait, 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 what? Do, do, excuse me. Excuse. <laughs> what? Rewind. What happened? what happened? I said that I'm not a person that gets out of no, my no, we place. Heard that part. We heard that part. Uh, <laughs> so that's either man. for oh, yeah man, okay. or my. <laughs> If I was to have a man in there around, oh. and that's for them. Okay, so you're single. Oh. Okay. <laughs> and be honest. This it's right here. The, yeah, yeah, yeah. the single yeah. life is better than having a significant other right now, right? No, I want a relationship. I'm not one of them. Oh, you, you want a relationship? Those, <laughs> okay, like so okay, like so let, let's mm. let's get to deep. Okay, right. so <laughs> no, nah, there are people who like to have. Somebody. Why don't you have a significant other? Mm. I'm, I'm not trying to. No, no. I, 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 let me let me let me. That that tone was bad. Let me not say that. Is there a reason why you don't have a significant? Other? I talk to people, you know. <laughs> no, but I can't. It's too crazy. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's just, it's just, it's, it's. So nobody a wants a wife. You. Mean, nobody wants. Nobody likes you. No, people like me. They like you. You're, you're, yeah, you're not like from New York. Me. They love you more. Yeah. Right. Yeah, yeah but yeah. I, I talk to someone that's, but it's okay. just, just, yeah, it's just, it's just right. there. It's just open. Mm-hmm. Okay. As it's it open. should be. As 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 2021 as it should be. Because I can't fuck with these girls right now, my nigga. These new generation, I, I can't do it. Me personally, I can't. The new generation, I, I don't even talk. I don't even like talking to younger guys. So, is there a time limit? Like, is there a, for a woman, especially in you, your career, what you do? Is there like a time limit? Like, you talking to a dude? Is he on a clock? Does he have yo? You got a week to make to make something right, or you up out of here, or is it? You I just go know. off vibe, yo. I just go off of vibe. I'm I don't think you did it as off. I'm not a time with limit. It. A time for what? Like, what are you no, doing? No, there's girls who really walk around like, yo, do you want to? It's clock. crazy. You can't like, put you your life I mean? on the time. As, you're, like, it's, you do got things, three days to make it look right, <laughs> or he's up out of here. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I mean? We've had people, you know, come even on on this show, you know, who who express it in a sense like certain dudes like. 
they got like three days to make it look right or you know what is making right? How, how does a person get to go on to the a, get to go on a date with Morning Star six six six? six, six, six. <laughs> how they how they do that? I'm asking. What's a good um, date? What what is a good date to you? Because you're from the south, mm. so standards is lower in the south, right? Oh wow! <laughs> I'm just wow. I'm just being real. <laughs> no, it's, lo- it's not. Yeah. No, it's, it's easy. definitely Pull up what. At the- Pull up at the big bitches in this. Hold up, pull up at the rim shack. Hold on, you know who y'all had before that was I, nigga Duro. Remember Duro? Who is Duro? Who the fuck is that? She don't even know who Duro is. Duro. Yeah, buddy. Wow, you're bugging. You're bugging. Duro. Niggas said, yeah, buddy. Who is that big shot? Out of all people, you're gonna say him for the south. That nigga put y'all on the right side. We're not even starting Atlanta. Just in Texas alone, there's other big artists. Other than that, there's Spit. Slim Thug. The there's there's Slim Thug. Oh, Slim Thug. Say the truth. Slim Thug from there. This Houston. No, that's, that's Texas. Texas. I'm from. Oh, oh, oh. I'm from. I'm from. I'm gonna get myself a deal. Nah, nah, nah. My bad. My bad. My bad. My bad. My bad. Nah, you know I'm gonna get myself a deal. I'm gonna get myself a deal. Yo, I'm like, Yo, but I forgot about it. Okay, keep going. Right, my bad. My bad. Slim Thug. He did. He did okay. There's Slim Thug. There's Bumbi. There's Mike Jones. There's Zero. There's Trey the Truth. There's Paul Wall. I'm because it was in my mind, it was division yeah. between Dallas and Houston. I don't know why. It just yeah, it's on Texas. My bad. I apologize. But Dallas, I don't think <laughs> nah, Dallas so, really I apologize. Houston, and to all the niggas, I apologize. I don't think Dallas. <laughs> no, for real. Dallas is an ill city, though. Dallas is an ill city, though. Dallas, 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 Dallas got you got Dallas. Um, <laughs> you got Yellow Beezy. You got Yellow Beezy. That's on me, baby. Yeah, you got some. Yellow Beezy. You got some. Um, Mo. Um, Mo. Yeah. Yo, you know I swear to God, I don't know what I thought Dallas was, my nigga. You thinking like San Antonio? Yeah, I'm wild. I, my bad, son. I, I apologize. You feel me? Tell yeah. J Prince. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you better right. tell J Prince. Yeah, you better <laughs> go in with your mask or hoodie on. But hey, 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 sir, sir. Like, sir, did you apology. check in? You got, you got no mob ties, man. Nah, that's a fact. Yeah, yeah honestly, on, I, I might be banned from Houston now. So Yo, right. I apologize. Nah, real talk. Nah. There was a big difference definitely in my lit. mind between Dallas and Houston. And they've been lit, though. It's yeah. not like new. Yeah, Dallas is more. Dallas, I think, is more new, but. Yeah, yeah, yeah it, it, downtown bit. Dallas yeah. is more. You know, you, know what, you know what? You know what it is. Let me. I'm gonna be real. I was supposed to move to Dallas one time. That's what it is. You know Dallas is a nice city, and I got so much animosity. I went to high school. You know what I'm saying? Or, Arlington. What's that spot? They got that um music. Um, v, thing the, over is V Live down there? No, I'm well. B, yeah, but V Live started in Houston. Austin that they got South by Southwest. Yeah, 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 yeah in uh, Austin. Yeah, my bad. What, bro? You fucking. Yo, I thought Dallas was some other shit. You know why? Because I was supposed to move down there. That's what it was, my nigga. So because you moved instead down there, of, it's, it's a whole yeah, other area? And I, and I got animosity. That's what it is. Let me get to the root of it. You know what I'm saying? There was some shit called Whataburger. What's that shit down there? Whataburger. Oh, that's amazing. You see what I'm saying? Whataburger. I was like, I was like, That's good. I was, I was good, bread. Why well, it's like White Castle, you feel what I'm saying? But let's stick to what you were saying of how it's low standards over there. Yeah. That's what you were saying. Compared though. to New York, honestly, it is, bro. Okay, well, no, 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 it's just the thing. New York people are bougie. Y'all, y'all are stuck up. We bougie, but just, we live in the hood. Think, <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like, the thing is, like New Yorkers, y'all trying to be this upscale thing, but a lot of people live with their parents still. A lot of people Ooh, don't know how to drive. Soon, a lot of people soon. don't have a driver's license. Mm-hmm. You well, I wouldn't say they don't know and, how to and, drive. And, I mean, the the the. But, but they don't have the license. You're right about the, that. The the apartment, I mean, how much the rent is, and stuff like yeah, that. It's Me coming out here, I get it in a way. But at the it's same time, you still. But at the same time, y'all, it's still a lot of people that is thirty still living with their parents. That's a fact. Whereas in Texas, I haven't lived with my parents since I was I left high school. Let's talk. Let's your talk, queen. But, but, okay, okay. Now let me let me break this one down to you now, right? So now the reason why I wanted to move the now I don't want to. It was a suggestion, right? It was a suggestion. It was it was a suggestion that I should move in Dallas. I was like, oh, let me check this shit out. Yo, back it was like it was like ten years ago. What's the what's the usual pricing over there? What's the, what's the rates? Like Twelve hundred, right, for two bedroom, right? Mm-hmm. Listen, listen, right? listen, right? Mm-hmm. This shit is at a gym. I went downstairs. I'm like, 
oh, well, I'm gonna kill these niggas. Mm. Feel me? I'm like, yo, I watch niggas play balls at half court. I'm like, they got a gym, they got a pool. I'm like, why? Well, it's a lot for 1200 But I'm like, I don't know nobody. How I'm gonna get money? I, I don't know. Yo, How I'm gonna get bread out there? It's gonna be your job. Which, yeah, like, well, I'm sure yeah. they got work out there. Like I said, I don't know how I was gonna work out there, my nigga. Like, what is it to do out there? Ten yeah. years ago, not yeah. not that, not now. You gotta kind of figure it out. Now it's hard because everything. I'm sure everything now it's a lit city, yeah. Brody. I'm now sure it's a lit city. Back then, I thought I was gonna move down. Wherever you got an ill sports but listen, right? I'm, I ain't gonna lie. I'm from the I'm from the Jets, right? I'm from the Jets in BK, right? And I ain't gonna lie to you, right? Like when I had got a, a house, when I finally my family got a house, right? It was in Southside, right? I thought I made it, my nigga. I was like, yo, for the Jackson South Side, I'm good bread. But the they was talking to the crazy niggas like, oh, this nigga. Nigga, nigga, you live in South, South Side, my <laughs> nigga. Like, your cousin fat cats. I'm yeah. like, what you mean, my <laughs> nigga? Like, but I liked it, though. I'm like, what you mean? Because you, it's, it's levels. You coming from Brooklyn. But no, you see what no she just said. She's like, yo, how you acting bougie levels. and y'all niggas, you know what I'm saying? Nah, but, but the price but is high levels. in New York. Yeah, but then you're going to say people from... Texas and probably lower end, but why? Because no, they're I, more no, no. humble. No, no. Because me, they're no. more like why? He's saying no, no. I, you know what? I, I gotta, I gotta start rephrasing the man shit. status. He think y'all at the rib shack every day. What? Because that's people that <laughs> maybe, yeah. maybe maybe y'all appreciate life more. And better. <laughs> Good one. You trying to say they struggle? They appreciate life more. No, Yo, because you because be a no, because y'all no, y'all try, not, y'all no, make money to try to look I'm, a certain way more than a person. Thank you. Let's get uh, to it. Let's get to it. Okay. More than maybe a person in the south is more like. I mean, but I don't. How is more it, Lord? Knows more work. Yeah, more work, more, but. Mm -hmm. Cause a, New York, because a New York nigga will look flashy. Nah, but New York but not is not being the best too. living condition. Yeah, nah, let's facts. not get it twisted. New York is and you know what's crazy too. in New, New York? York is that's a wave no, too. New York thing, is grand. Yeah. You survive in New York with these. No, prices one thing is that I've learned in me being in New York is learned me. It, it, um, I was taught to be more tough. Okay. You know, um, I learned how to move. Mm -hmm. I know how to really work um, fast. Exactly. And hard and fast. really know how to make money. A lot of people, especially this came from me. I have no family here. I have nothing. I've never lived with no one. So, um, and I lived in with some of the best places in New York City. Mm. So for that and be to be able Dola. to, yeah, Dola and to be able to pay my Let's rent, go. five thousand rent, mm. forty eight hundred okay, rent. Okay, okay. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Raise his hat over. Um, <laughs> okay. New York really learned, really taught me Hold how to really make <laughs> money and keep going and work. And in New York City, every dollar counts. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So now when and, but I... But in New York City, me? you always spend too. So it's like you got to always like... As you get in, you, it's yeah. going. Yeah. yeah, you got to always like keep going. That's a fact. And, and then, you, can't, and you can't be pussy. You be pussy and people's going to eat you up, even the taxi drivers. On speak on it. <laughs> speak and that, on it. And that's why they mad at me because when I, I count every dollar in New York City. I count it every dollar, period. So like, and even the script club. I, I gave you 400 singles, but... Where's my 400 singles back? I'll give you 400 dollars, but like, nigga, no, because when you, the thing is, back. when you go in a strip club, see, <laughs> no, you, some, you know, you know what I'm saying? Like, my nigga, like, they mad at me see, for like, sometimes those people like, dollars. No, like, nah, like, people like this? you sometimes don't need to be in a strip club because you don't really Whoa! understand. Just yeah. No, you listen, no, 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 really, no, 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 because you don't really understand how it works and how the workers are in a strip club. Like, the dancers, they're not getting paid hourly, the bartenders are not getting paid hourly at the end of the day. They're there for hours from 8 to 4 a.m. So then when you get a guy like, not to say like you, but not when you get God, a guy yeah, yeah. like um, <laughs> that, that comes up front and just want to talk the whole night and not even pay or not even spend or not even tip, this mm -hmm. worth is like, get out of here because I got to make money. Like I'm going, show. some of us be going home where, and then bartenders, sometimes our drawer may be short, right? And sometimes if we if if our managers are saying that it's short five hundred, we got to split that. Then the singles that we have, me and my partner are splitting that. Sometimes, even though some a lot of times we make a bag, there's nights where we will be negative going home at night mm -hmm. because there's some guys that are sitting in front of us that just, just want to talk time. the whole yeah. night. You like me? You're saying that you like me so much, and then you like me spend, nigga. Yeah, and then spend. There's True some guys. Though. There's some guys that will keep getting a drink. For fifteen dollars and really take their five dollar singles back, and then oh, get uh, mad out of the twenty, out of the 20 mm. and then get mad because I'm telling you that I have customers coming yeah, now. Yeah, yeah, this yeah, city yeah. just because you was there all night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah so that's basically, so, so, so let's no, we got, we got to put the standards out for the guys that want to do that. First of all, if you go to a strip club, period, you, you should, you should know you're going to be spending money. money. You should, Negative. You're no, going to a strip club, no. fifteen hundred. Real talk. No, huh? real talk. Honestly, what? honestly, I feel any man. It, who's going in the strip club? This is me personally. 
no less than a stat. It, well, That's I, just no. Look, why I, are we in a strip? We in a strip club. I will even say this. No, on. I will even say this. We know what's going it, on. I will even say this. Sometimes it even could d- just depend on your financial bracket because there's some guys that will come early um, to Starlets. Um, some guys that that maybe are a regular nine to five. They just want to oh, see us. Just a you know what I'm saying? And, and yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. And um, they will maybe spend. And there's guys that maybe tip me a hundred dollars, and I'll talk to him the same way of a guy that's spending five thousand mm-hmm. dollars just because you're coming and you're tipping me and you're being nice and then you go you yeah. know what i'm saying yeah. so but he's moving accordingly yeah yeah he's not you're, sitting there like yeah said, you're not trying wasting. to waste my time yeah, there's exactly. guys that have spent a bag years ago and then they come in the club and then wanted to have a seat and then not because spend nothing what, living off what they did yeah living off like you did years, years ago. ago and then you get <laughs> mad at me because i need to move you yeah <laughs> You don't get yo, you niggas like Patrick Ewing, yo. Yo, I know your jersey <laughs> Raptors, but yo, yeah. Boss Smith, yeah, nah. where's your pass? This is for real, though. You're not good right now. Nah, but that's for real, sad. though. That's, you know what it is? It's sad truth, but, but it's, it's business. It's, it's business. business. It's business. You're as good as your last deed. That's what people If yeah. I spent 15000 yesterday, that don't mean I'm going to spend That don't mean yeah. I spent 200 That's why I said, if you step into a strip club, honestly... Just know when you're going to a strip club, you you gotta know like yo, you about to. Spend you should want to spend something. You know that. You should you should at least know that there may be a pretty girl, whether you're getting dances or if it's a bartender you're talking to and having conversation with. You should want to be able to spend something on that girl because none of us are getting paid hourly. It's all off of tips. But, but you know what's crazy that that's the first time I'm actually hearing it, hearing it like yeah, they don't but get paid hourly. I know that, but there's a lot of guys that just go there and be like yo, what? She good. She brush. She making man money. She good. I can, I can take. I can take four drinks like, and chill. Why are you counting my pockets? Like, <laughs> I'm just going by. This is what niggas. Do. I, I know, you know, know what but that's what I'm saying. That's what like how they we. The, be. They don't know the bartender's yeah. like, standards. Yeah. But just imagine too. You in there? What, let's say what, what's the club night going for? What, what time? Like midnight? What we? What, what doors open with ten? Um. Yeah. Eleven. Ten. 10 eleven. 11. You going into like four? I mean, when things was open, you going into like four, mm-hmm. four thirty. Mm-hmm. Oh, let's be real. A buck, if Shorty's looking crazy, is going in ten minutes. Mm-hmm. That's a fact. So how long you stayed here, that, bro? That, that's why. That's what I'm saying. Like, like, yo, my nigga, like, stack, you know what it's like? A the, stack is mm-hmm. like two. If you if you lucky and you really moving right, you might got half an hour. Exactly. I spend I spend you know money. I've went to girls bars you and spent me? money. So come on, my like, own money. You coming in there with a buck? You, you, you know, <laughs> right? You, know, you pay your ten at the door. That? You got your buck. You holding on to it. Shorty, look at she's shaking for a second, and she moving on to the homies over there. And that you can't even you. be mad at that. I mean, let, let's let's go to since you've been to Dallas, Texas. <laughs> respectfully, 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 Texas. You know what I'm saying. Oh, she said, and you Dallas went to NYC. School, What's the difference between the guys there? And the guys in New York City that you've mm. witnessed, that you noticed, Dallas or Houston? I'm I was Texas, it's the Texas whole state. Because I, I, I fucked up, I fucked up saying Dallas. I, was re- and, I went to college in Houston, so that's more of my more party real. life. Okay, all right, yeah, all right. Thank you. Um, so yeah, okay. from from there to New York, guys wise, how was it? Your transition, you, guys you, in New York you. is so hard to approach a little bit. Wait, you approach guys? No, I don't approach people. Oh, you approach dudes? Oh, are you saying people approaching just, me? Yeah, because just, I thought yeah, I'm thinking just, about the bar. Nah, hold on, hold on. No, no, no. Yeah, <laughs> like, oh, yeah. oh, I didn't know you approach guys. I don't That's approach people do? at all. Oh, okay. Well, sometimes. No, 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 no. No, no. no the <laughs> only, the only, the only way that I have ever approached or been, because I can be kind of assertive, mm-hmm. is if a guy is giving me... Like eye contact. eye contact or something okay. like that, and I do want him. It's been times where I tell like I give me your phone and I put my phone, my number oh, in his word? phone, just, and then just, just walk up I'll to walk him, off. Give me your phone. Yeah, give me your phone. I put my a number. A New York in. person wouldn't think that you would do that, huh? A New York nigga wouldn't but think that. That's some New York shit though. Yeah, they wouldn't. That's but New York, York shit. But New, New Yorkers, I get. That's why I say New Yorkers are kind of hard. They just sit they there. Like, yeah, they just sit there. Like, and New York, a lot shit. of New Yorkers when you come to the bar, they it would be a group of guys and they would just sit and go in their phone. And then I'll be looking like, like hey, you know you let's take a shot. Right. Yeah, like, yeah. like, what's up? Like, they'll be in their phone, not wanting to talk. Like, it's weird. 
But what about Texas guys? What about Texas, Texas is more approachable. Texas guys come more to spend a bag. When they come in the strip club, oh, so they New come York, in the, and they're ready. Y'all got no bread, my No, nigga. no, New York is... New York, New York <laughs> no, is... Strip, nigga, stripping is spit. different. Poetic nigga, justice strip, the strip, shit. The stripping is different, It's though. different, but it's different. But New Yorkers got a bag. Niggas got a bag, but they're just more like... They just more they wait and they're more like you know what i'm saying like they just wait and then they, they kind of work more and and a lot of them i guess they don't like to also show because niggas trying to set up like it's a lot of <laughs> sh- a lot of things shit to worry about here. as a man that, in yeah New York. yeah so and, but in, in in the south niggas are already like after a while once you come in there it's like all right it's you time to bust it and, and, and that's a, and no matter who's and, around and, and that's just a carry state right yeah See what I'm saying? They good. Like, what y'all blame this nigga, my nigga? Yeah. New York? Nah, Brody. You can't. You can't. But, can't. But New York can never be a carry state, son. No, it can no, never. No, like, hell never. no. We're too close. We're, on t- we're too on top of each other. That's like Philly. Philly's not a carry state, right? Nah. I mean, I, I hope not. City, yeah, but yeah, when we're too on top of each other, you can't, you can't do that. These other states, you know, the houses mm. are separate. You got your land. You got this and that. Let's, 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 let, 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 let's, let's get to good times in New York City. Right? Mm. Let's get to some superb time. So, when you like these guys, right? What happens? How do you get them? What do you mean? What How do I get them? What yeah, what what, what, what wows, wows somebody from stuff? Dallas, Texas? What wows her? Mm. <laughs> you know what? Dallas, mm. Texas. That was dope. Or oh, that that got me. What, Are you simple, that? girl? Are you flashy? Are you? Um, I'm a little of both. I like a guy that's quiet. And it's chill and not like so flamboyant in the club. Okay. But I like a guy that's like that. And then you're he's, cool. So he's, you're cool with the, the club guy. You're cool with my man. He's a club guy. He's, I can go to the strip club with my man. And okay. we're both. My I'm the dancer is sitting on my man and we're having fun. Okay. Like okay. I'm not like that. <laughs> so, okay. I mean. And if I said that, that's only because you was from that was Texas. Niggas maybe. be mad at me. Yeah, because a New York girl's not allowing that like that. Is that what? mentality going no, to the bedroom? No, because... Uh-huh. That mentality let's, is different. No, let's get spicy with it. Does no, that mentality have... go in the bedroom is my question. Does that mentality like... You know what? Let's bring her like, home. Yo, do we do things like that? Mm, sometimes. Okay. 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 And it's more of you or more of him? Like, you what promote you it or he be like, yo, honestly... Just no, I mean... Okay. Mm. Yeah. So you do a lot of... Let me say a lot. You do some three-way calls. I can sometimes okay. if I if I have a man and you're my man, then yeah. All right. So you feel like every man? <laughs> no, I'm, every I'm just man. asking a question. Yeah, <laughs> I see. I see. No, I am. I am. I you're saying that every. Is <laughs> <laughs> you tired of to this? Why like, did I start this? Every man, that just talking about my whole thing. He went to so, Why did so I you start feel like this? Every man. <laughs> no, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm asking the people. You feel me? The, I, that's yeah. the people. No, ask yeah. me what the people want to know. So, like now, uh-huh. when you go to strip club, and I'm saying you with your man. Do you feel like all of your boyfriends deserve another girl as well? No, I've never did that with she all said my. It's her I said, it's no, I'm, I'm saying you, you, you the so big she homie. Unless who deserves it, it's if she. Wants if you to feel it, so does it does it depend on like how the girl look, how the girl energy is, and then you're like, you know, what, I can fuck well, let's fuck around. It, I mean, I just don't pick any girl. No, it's, I so know that. it I'm always saying. depends on. The girl's energy or how the girl is or I don't even like, actually like random girls like that. Okay. So it's usually I know the person. Oh, so. it is. Okay. See, all right. I told I'm you, ha- smoking I, I, hookah I, turns into you kisses. Said that, Nobody believes me. Because there's some people mentality is if we're gonna do something like that, it's got to be, you know, out the country on vacation. We don't know this person. No, that's but you're, weird. You're, I don't. I don't so like to. Rather, I don't like you know to do anything with anyone that I don't know. That's, you you don't have a fear of. Them on the low, texting each other. Doing no, their because thing. if I, I usually if, if I am doing it, I trust the guy more than I trust the girl, mm-hmm. most of the time. Because okay. if with my my dude, I'm usually I trust the guy more than I trust the girl. And then if it's with someone that I know, mm-hmm. you're not going to try to do shit behind my back to lose me with someone that I know a friend. Because you know you're you're gonna find out. Yeah, I'm gonna find out. It's uh-huh. either gonna be me or her, and you're not gonna choose. Her more than me. I feel like if it's a random girl, okay. then they're more likely to do that because that bitch doesn't give a fuck about me, and I'm not gonna see her no more. What if he jams her crazy though? <laughs> what if he jams her crazy and she's like, "Yo, I don't want to let this go." This have, you, have, you, have you ever got jealous of the way he was jamming a girl no. in front of you? Mm-mm. Have you ever had a double chick? 
Like she's hitting you up. Like a few repeat, days repeat, later, repeat, like, repeat, hey, repeat. what six, y'all six, doing six, this six, weekend? Six. Or nah, you like, like, yo, you know, let's we're go. good. Let me, co- let me tell him we about to come to his house real quick. Oh, you say, fuck it, let's do it, let's do it. <laughs> I, don't, no, 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 no. I, don't, I don't never have nobody that's calling me up like, oh, let's do it again. And they won't disrespect me like that. Oh, okay. So it'll never be nothing like that. Like well, a girl. I'm not saying fiending, but just you could tell the energy. Yeah, of, no, but no girl, let's do no, this again. no girl's never going to like initiate it doing oh, it again to okay, me because right. they're not ever going to disrespect scared. me. Okay. It don't matter if they're scared or not. You, they're you not going to disrespect that as me though. Um, for a girl saying let's do it again? Well, she's like, oh, I'm dying for her I, to no, ask but, me No, but I've had... No, but just a girl saying... I mean, saying, I've hey, had you know. where we've talked about it and it was like, oh, you know, that shit was lit or whatever, whatever, mm-hmm. but then I'd be like, yo, let's go over there. I would initiate it still. It wouldn't oh, be them wouldn't, like, okay, all right. oh, I want, I want your man's dick again. No, like, I'm just saying you would take it as disrespect <laughs> if they were to even ask you because um, you said like, you know, the disrespect. Yeah, I mean, yeah, like what are you talking about? Oh. Why are you saying that you want... How dare you? What do you mean? Yeah, I mean, you can always say it was fun. You know, we have fun, this and that. But for you to be feeding for it to do it again, mm-hmm. relax. That's yours. I guess. Yeah. So she got to just chill and act like that wasn't the time of her life. <laughs> she got, she got Basically, right? She no, got to chill and be like, nah, it was okay. But it's like, yeah, oh, my God, what is this going to hit me? <laughs> no, I've had where they said it's so tonight? much fun, but it's never where it's like a girl's feeding. Like, you got to ask me to do it. Mm-hmm. It's all through you, I think. Yeah. <laughs> gotcha. Any any after the script club, any one night stands? We got no. Never, yeah. never. Years got ago. Into that. Years oh, so ago. Years ago. <laughs> like, nigga, not, not the eleventh. <laughs> not March eleventh, but you, I'm just saying, you like, in, in, Texas too? in general. Uh huh. You bartended in Texas no. too? No. 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 Oh, Tina. One time. Tina. Um, Colada introduced her. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. All right. I actually pulled up on Tina on a bar. I didn't know her at all. She was oh. the only brown skinned girl, and I was like, "Oh, she's pretty." And I sat at her bar and spent money. How did you yeah. connect to her? Because she liked her the way she looked. She, mm-hmm. seen her. she was okay. pretty. She was a pretty at the time during Starless. I was before Aces. She was the only brown skinned girl oh. that they had. Mm-hmm, that they had Starless at the bar. Is mad heights, right? Mad mm-hmm. Then they then they had they had a few. It was Bernice back then, and um, I think Panda was then. <laughs> yeah, it was it was a few. And Bernice elevated. Yeah, I mean, what do you mean? I don't know what you mean by that. <laughs> no, Bernice definitely elevated. She, in that's her cool. way, in her fashion. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's what's up. So what do, you, what do you see yourself doing, like, years down the line? Well, I haven't bartended in a year since this quarantine, so I don't know really if I'm going back to that. Oh, you, have, you haven't bought it? Oh, you've mm-hmm. hosted. So, all right. I've only hosted. I've, hosted I have not like bought it. I'm just partying. On, on the low, between me and you, I think hosting is like bartending. That's no, what I was not. taking it it's not. I'm not, so pouring, it? I'm not pouring guys drinks. I don't have to sell bottles. I don't have to do none of that. I'm in my space with so my don't friends know. wearing Your my face clothes. Is saying like you, you're not, you're not you're shitting on it. Yeah, you're her not, face is like, you're not, no, I'm yeah, shitting yeah. on that now. No, I, <laughs> I bartend and I have fun, but I'm just saying that hosting and bartending is different. It's bartending different, is right. more working and you're working for your money. You're dance, you know, you're dancing, maybe shit. You have to hope for niggas to come and spend money on you. Right, and right. hosting, you're Good already, set, they, they're paying for your hotel, they're, they're paying you for your tell. flight. And we're already set for how much money we're getting for the night. All we got to do is get there at the time, be there for an hour, party. And promo. And promo. promo. Post the fly that night. So they're paying for the the fly-ins and all that? Flight and hotel. Yeah. That's dope. So in that manner, I would say the South is definitely bigger than New York. New York, I feel New York dudes ain't flying shit in and they're not really flying the New York, the, a lot of promoters they will maybe host us but it's the amount of money isn't the same and then with mm-hmm. starlets um starlets actually had it to where we could not host well, um, other spots? no in new york we couldn't host because oh. we were only four starlets so unless they yeah. were putting Starlet's brand then we maybe we're starlets was dope though like but starlets was bringing in money though yeah starlets, bringing starlets the money. was bringing in money so he's bringing the money, that but club. that's, you know, so we, we would get booked more other places, but that's where like Atlanta, other places, they, they would love us going outside because they don't see us all the time. They don't see us there. you have to there. like sign contract or... No, we don't have to sign that thing. Mouth. It's just, it's they'll, so give verbal, us, they'll, they'll give us a deposit oh, okay. and then after, it, after the end, then they'll give us the rest. Oh, okay, okay. But How- Star- Atlanta's, the hospitality and everything is amazing. They fed us and all that. 
with hosting, so mm-hmm. that was nice. Ever been approached by artists? I mean, no names are needed, but, you know, like... Yeah, that's all the same. That's regular. Artists come up, hey, what's up, da, 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 pull up, and you be like... Pull up? Yeah. I mean, I don't really know about that, but hitting you up and stuff like that, yeah, that's yeah. regular. Okay. Everyone, you get all types of people. When you, when you di- when you're when you're bartending or when you're hosting, you're in the light like that. You will get all types of people. You'll get artists, rappers, mm-hmm. um, athletes, mm-hmm. D boys, even mm-hmm. um, professional men. Like you would get professional men. Yeah, like people that are actually having not the regular nine to bro. five, but have. Um, Let me not say real bill, but they have some cash. Yeah, that they, they yeah that they have money in the system. Oh, okay, they actually right. have money. That's okay, what I mean. All right, okay, I got yeah, you get any. I was say I thought every man is professional. <laughs> like I said, let's get back to you. What kind of guys you like? Mm. What, kind of, <laughs> what kind of guys do you like? Mm, I like a little bit of everything, I guess. Okay, and I that guess. is. Um, I don't know. Are we I tone, like, are we tone, spur the moment, differential, like, we dark skin, light skin. Um, I like both. Fat. I like light skin and dark skin. Mm-hmm. Um, I like a guy that's more in control, I guess, mm-hmm. someone that I can follow. Okay. I guess. And, mm, do D-Boys no. attract you? Uh, I do like D-Boys, but um, I would like, if it's a D-boy, then you have to be working to have something also in the system. Like, you're just not straight D-boy. D-boy cause then it's like... <laughs> he, might get it. he might be going in a few. Where are we going? <laughs> <laughs> it's a he might not be it's a good months. team. They could lose in the second <laughs> round. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I feel you. I feel you. I yeah. I but I'm, I'm around. I'm around everyone. Okay. All right. Mm-hmm. So now... You saying that <laughs> there's a person, but he's not two, but he's around. So, how do you maneuver with it's here? That? I, I, listen, the re up is here. No, no, my thing is this. <laughs> my thing is, is this. Here. How do you maneuver <laughs> with a situation like that? Like, all right, I got someone I'm talking to, but maybe he's not fully committed yet. But it's like, but I'm still outside. I still got to move how I move. How do you maneuver with that to keep him? Calm and comfortable, like he still wants to be fully involved. Because a dude could say, "Damn, she be moving around a lot. I really like her, but I can't do too much because she's she just came from Atlanta. I'm watching Justin LaBoy's Grand. He's saying all type of shit about Atlanta. I can't really do too much. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to look like the sucker. So it's like, you know what I mean? Like, how do you maneuver to keep a person like, yo, I'm here, but I still gotta do what I do." You know what I mean? The, the comfortability. How does that work? I mean, my situation's open, but I really don't deal with guys that show in, insecurity like that because but I, feel I mean, every guy has some form of insecurity. Yeah, a little bit. That's but insecure. I mean, but that's, that's but that's, that's insecure. It, no, yeah, but that's, in a sense, well, I see what no, you're saying. But yeah, go ahead. I'm sorry. If sorry. if you're just if you're panicking just because I'm going out of town or doing stuff like that, then yeah, that kind of shows insecurity because. I ain't doing shit. <laughs> well, imagine and, it the other way, but, though. And he's not doing shit either. You go have fun with your friends. Like, you I'm cool not like that. that. Yeah, go have fun. You should go out of town. You, what? you cool with the guy trips? Yes, go All have right. fun. Like, I'm not, like, I cannot keep you. I, I feel like a person that's trying to do that, that, that makes a guy cheat. A guy's going to cheat and do whatever he wants to do either way. He's either going to hide or it's either going to be. So when you just allow a guy to just go and do his own thing, mm-hmm. I feel like, Half of the time, he ain't even gonna really like. It's he ain't gonna, gonna do like, nothing. Yeah, he's you like, know that like, he's like, really it's boy, just like, yeah. And saying? sometimes that happens because sometimes people look at me and my friends and they're thinking that we just don't be out by ourselves or chilling when we do. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we we go out section. and we have fun. We're out the country and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. We be by ourselves most of the time, you mm-hmm. know, and having a great time. Okay. And then say, like, with the situation, if I'm in a situation, a lot of the times, like, I'm on the phone where he's telling me, why are you calling? Have fun with your friends. Like, like, why are you hitting me up? Ain't you out? Yeah, like, aren't you out? Go have fun. So, Like I said before, what is a good date night? Um, A good date night with me. Um, I love sports. I love sports. Okay. Love it. So anything maybe that has to do with that. Um, I love music. 
Um, I would love to. I like to, when I'm in Texas, I actually, me and my sister like to go to um, the House of Blues or Eric Badu. Okay. Always like performs and stuff like that. I love music like that. I love R&B. Oh, so that's your style of music, R&B? Yeah, I love Way trap. Back. I love, no, I love trap and gangster <laughs> rap and all that when I'm out, but I listen to a lot of R&B Eccentric and stuff like that. Yeah. Right. Next. Yeah. 112. Yeah. BTCs. Jacket Edge. <laughs> Case. Jamie Foxx. Oh, okay. like, <laughs> Nah, Jamie had a run. I ain't gonna do yeah, that. I feel her. I see where she going with Jamie it. Definitely had Jamie a had a run, run with, the, with the singing. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. She yeah. sounded like she, that was a CD, you know? Like, like she was oh, popping. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's from there. Nah. Yeah, from Texas. Yeah, yeah. Jamie Foxx. Jamie's from Texas? He's from yeah. Dallas. Oh. He's from Dallas. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's what's up. I didn't know he was from Texas. Yeah. Keep going. Date's not over. Keep um, going. I mean, that's the old artist because I'm definitely like 90s kind of vibes. Like all them, Jagged Edge, all them. Um, but then new artists, I like Summer Walker, um, her. She's shy. Who? Summer she, Walker? She's yeah, shy? yeah, but her music, their music is amazing. Her music is I don't real. Think she's shy. Her music is dope, mm-hmm. for sure, but I don't think she's shy. She's a really good I think singer. She's to herself a lot, but. Can, can, you, can you be with somebody that you make more money than them? I'd rather not. <laughs> what we're going to do is go back. Honestly. Wait, honestly. Back. Honestly. Honestly. Quickly. What you mean, though, son? I'd rather not. I mean. You make if, a quick bag, though. <laughs> like. I'd rather what not. Me? I mean, if if I'm I'm not like that, like, I, no, no, I will. Okay, you know, like, I will. If it's a guy that I do like and I make less than him, I would hope that he has um, enough in him to want to start <laughs> making more than me. So I got to see Ambition. that. Like, yeah, you got to you gotta be work. You can't be on your ass and I'm still making more than you. You're comfortable with that. It was just never going to work because like I said, I love my man to be a man. Mm. So and then, Okay, and you're a man. So for him to be a man, then he has to have bread. Honestly, so I would, No, I was like him to make more than me. Are you comfortable I feel spending like, Yes, I spend. I spend on my man. I spend oh, on man. you know, like I'm. I, I'm gift giving. I'm all. I'm all that. But I'm a person that um, I like to be a woman, and mm-hmm. I like my man to be a man. So I would like my man to pay the bills and stuff I was like about that. Say, are you a half and on the bills type of person? Or no, no, no. I would. Hey, you <laughs> nigga. You're crazy. crazy. No, no. STK seventeen hundred. This is you. Here, here, I you, would go. Like, here you go. Here you go. <laughs> I would like my man to pay the bills and I would like for me to clean and cook and make sure that you, when you come back, the food's on the table, the kids is stuff so like that. And still me make money. So you saying you saying more Nigga, all bills. Nigga, AB. Everything. Nigga. The, if lights, we're living together, the everything, bills. Gas, the everything. bills. But if we're living together, the bills. But I still will take care of if there's something that you need that I see that you need, I'm already buying that myself. Okay. Or if it's something that the kids need that I see that, you know, I'm, I still want to make money myself. Okay. Um, I just don't want to be a stay-at-home person but again well, it has he has m's and like, you know what chill stay home chill i, I got you then what mm. i still kind of want to have my own <laughs> okay. i still kind of want to have my something. own yeah i want to i want to be able to do something because i don't want to have to ask you for money okay yeah okay that's, that's oh so with that's when when you're saying with you spending you're not like OD asking him at the same time. Yeah, I'm not know? asking him for money. I'm spending the money that I have. That you have. We're not your spending own. the money that he's giving you. If he's giving me money, then after yeah. that, that's my money. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it has nothing to do. Like well, it's I'm, mine now. So if I spend it on you, it's me spending it's, it. On it's you. mine. Like because yeah. I'm choosing to spend it on me or uh, spending it on, on you. you. And a I lot of women spend it on do. themselves. So. I, I, <laughs> <laughs> I see his spin and I see where she go with that's, it. That's, 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 that, that, that's respectable, son. Definitely. But like when you when you deal with these guys, right? Whoever you let you like, right? Do you ever debt a guy because sex is weak? Yeah. Mm. I, I, I even, if it, even if it's <laughs> even if it's a bag, even if it's bag, I, no, I, I cannot, I cannot, I cannot. Bags is not that's over. Bags the is not over an organ. Oh yeah, she said you're crazy. Yeah, yeah. That's the least, fam. Who are you here for? Are you talking about nigga? Yo, yo. <laughs> Yo. Uh, why did y'all bring me here? Nah, what, just bring to me set here. the tone. Is that's what you're here for. You heard? We here. Oh, you want to oh, chase or you want to... Yeah, man. We, that's what we're here for, Che. We're going to cheers to get your... Listen, get your... Listen, if you don't have cash, stay home, guys. So, I tell that's, you all a time. Good, that's a good thing. We spoke on this before, even on this show. Like, is it bag over sex? 
No, I cannot so, pretend. So the, you have to have the boat. But what if you, the bag is wild? What if the bag is an, an, an the bag elite? is wild? But <sighs> oh, that's pretty hard. That's very oh, okay. That's pretty hard. I don't know. I I I, I have to be into you. A bag doesn't mean anything oh, for me. Like I just can't fuck with you just because you have a bag. Own. Yeah, because I get my own. But still, I cannot pretend. Like I have to like you. In have you some ever faked way. the orgasm before? Mm-hmm. That's a different thing. Not even no different. That's just, yeah. So it goes on. Yeah, I mean that just happens. But for an investment or like just, no, just because no, no, I'm just, just, I just I no <laughs> investment. <laughs> Yo, my nigga, I know if I act like he was the greatest, I'm gonna get the greatest in my account. That's what it is. No, I don't be fucking. I don't be fucking niggas, niggas just because it's a bag, like or it's. If the sex not good, it's not good, and I probably will stop talking to you. But you would never tell him that you're honest with you. I'm okay. Oh yeah, are you? Are you? This is, this are is you like, blunt? Are you blunt with it? I mean, are you blunt with it? Now or? that I'm older, uh huh. And, and the role is here. Let the people no. know. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> let the people know it's here. No, yeah. now that I am older, I will not have sex with a person if I think that I'm not gonna like it, or if it's not. Wait, if you how do you, you know? know? Like, well, how you do you know? know? You look probably, like you can't even, fuck, if nigga. If, <laughs> even if the size probably isn't there, I'm not even gonna waste me in your time. So you stereotype. You see a nigga, you like, yo, you look like you can't fuck. I'm good. Nah, put your, yeah. put your hand over your face, my nigga. We gotta see you, my nigga. Yeah, yeah. We gotta see you. Yo, I ain't gonna lie. You look like you can't fuck, boy. Like, it's quiet. But <laughs> like, Just keep throwing dollars on this bar, though. You know what I'm saying? So, so if I went to a Jamaican club, I would think every Jamaican girl in there could fuck, right? Because she's can dancing. Wine. She's whining and dancing. Dance. That don't mean shit. Mean All right. Oh, okay. That doesn't mean nothing, right? And they're yeah. dancing. So how, do, how do you know? How, how the fuck do you know? If I see a Jamaican girl, she's dubbing this with Dutchy wine, Dutchy wine, going crazy, spin her head over, <laughs> crazy, right? Mm. And she can't clap. How do you know a nigga that can clap or not? I can't give. First of all, niggas be thirsty. They think I every can't, girl can clap. I can't. No, no. <laughs> but what's corny is that thinking. That, what, what, what's really trash is thinking that a girl, a nigga shouldn't even care if a girl can fuck or not. What, what does that mean? A, a, yeah, because. Like, you guys do don't care. Like, you yeah. don't fuck anything. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 no. As long as there's a bus, no, no, it's not about that. But like, I feel like a guy most set girls the tone do for not real. come like that with fucking guys. Like, it's not like a lot of girls are not coming. You guys just fuck because it's a bus. Like, you at the end for, of the day, y'all bus. Ourselves more than at the end of the day, y'all come. A lot of girls is not coming like that. They so. not and they lying. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and this, no, 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 because, no, no, because, because she, she just said, no, no, I'm only going by, I'm only going by what this lady, I'm only going by what this lady just said. She just said, I'm going to say, they're lying. They're lying. No. Because, you know what I'm saying? You be like, wait a minute. Yeah, they be lying. They be lying. I got you. I got you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yo, son. No, yo, yo, this guy's okay. crazy. You know what? Yo, this guy's crazy, son. This guy no, because crazy. you know, I'm saying you, <laughs> you invested. I'm not invested, but like you say, like yo, you you faked an orgasm before, mm-hmm. right? You said that. All right. So when I said that, you be lying. All right, nigga, what you mean? Well, I'm yeah, gonna, we back yo, full circle. Know, now, no, let me say this you, because your tone now sounded different from a second. Yes. <laughs> no, yo, you sometimes. lying. Right? You know what I mean? Like. Just because a girl does not orgasm does not mean the sex isn't good. It just it just doesn't happen like that for girls. Just wasn't that moment. So what is the what what kind of mood has to be set for you to have an orgasm? Uh, I I I I did not know. She wants to scolds all that. You know what I mean? I did did not know that answer. It's just just the moment (laughs) you know. The the moment that gets it, 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 that's what it is. I mean, (laughs) whatever. Yo, yo, you know. (laughs) I want to help the guys out there, my nigga, because there's niggas that listen. You know what it is? I have vision, right? And my uh, vision is she, she just lied vision? and said that, yo, sometimes she fakes an orgasm. Sometimes, right? She and didn't I, lie, though. She's all right, smoking. she didn't lie. She's all right, but I want the niggas to know, like, listen, mm-hmm. for you to know that she's not lying. Why would I snitch on myself? Huh? Why would she Why would I break that myself? down? I am no 
very far. She's no filter. She's from Dallas. I don't know, my nigga. I'm just I'm <laughs> asking the question, my nigga. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Nah, I get what she said, though. I get what she said. <laughs> I, 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 yeah, oh, he answer said, you got to answer it. Answer which one? Answer which one? Which one? Is it a penetration thing, or is it an only thing for you? Um, or what gets you to I, that I oral? actually probably like penetration more than oral. Thank you. Is it mood? Is it like, yo, dang, he's... It just the settings right. He's kissing you right. He's so, like, yeah, a lot you know of times it, it, yeah, it just it makes is. it even more. Whoa, yeah, but, yeah, you know actually, I mean? because it's not even just off of like it. It has to be like a huge size. It, oh. it doesn't have to just be like a huge. It can be average or whatever. But sometimes, like people that are big, don't know how to move it or don't know how to you know. And then sometimes there are people that are whatever. And just and so it could just be weird, like you know. So. Niggas is working. <laughs> You gotta work. <laughs> Whatever it is, dudes you gotta work. Feel it, yo, they got it. Yo, Bigger, small, or medium. Like, yo, you gotta some, work. But, is, you yo, gotta there is some people. There's sometimes where guys just are. They're just really like excited, and oh. it'll be like. Cause you're you're the best they ever had on some Drake shit. I don't know. I, allegedly, I really allegedly, allegedly, I'm not giving her that credit. Hell no. Allegedly to them, she's the best they ever had. She's from Texas and they say, like, oh, she's not from New York. This is crazy. And they, I don't, I don't, I don't even, I don't even entertain in those parts anymore. So. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> Niggas are so happy to be here. They're like, oh my God, I got morning stuff. I got morning stuff. Six, 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 six. And I'm at the cream in six, 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 six minutes. <laughs> I don't even entertain it, none of that. Yo, yo so the compliments that you get down there is immaculate. Down where? Down, <laughs> down there. Oh. <laughs> Not down south, nigga. So, all right, off the theory of you just looking at someone and saying, yo, like, I ain't fucking, because he don't look like he can fuck. Have you ever had a situation where another tender, she got right, she's like, yo, I ain't going to lie. Billy from last night, yo, <laughs> this nigga was wilding was on me last night. You like, have you ever like doubted somebody? I could have had him. But like, if, if you ever doubt somebody, you're not bringing them home to another. You're not doing that, right? If you doubt somebody, like honestly, this ain't can't fuck. Or you yeah, think she's dumping them at the bar. You just said that sometimes you'll take a girl home, right? Mm -hmm. But you're not gonna take her home to somebody that's trash, right? I'm only taking a girl home if that's my man. And that's my man, of course, the sex is great. Because I just said I don't entertain, don't entertain and bullshit. nothing that. And your man is never trash. No. Okay. To be her man. <laughs> to be, be trash. my man. No, I'm it probably doesn't go that far. Okay. Yeah. Right. Saying, yo, Clean record. Mrs. Can't... Perfect. All right, okay, all right. I understand. Girl, nah, she does that the means, qualifications. That means, that means girls is probably going to look at all my niggas and probably be like, wow, I need to try them because. <laughs> you know what I mean? Okay. <laughs> 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 she is yeah. dancing around so many good questions. What? She's not new to this shit. She's, she's, she's I think she's I'm answering star. everything. She's up early, right? Great. <laughs> this, this happening. Where did you get that name Morning Star from? My name is Sansere. It means Morning Star. Okay. Oh. And Sansere is what? It's Indian. That my father named me that, which He's in recently office. passed. Oh, rest okay. Rest in peace. Mm. COVID? Oh. Um, he did have COVID. Um and on that. he had COVID during, um, what is it? Is it March already? March, so. yeah. March, April. March. In April, he had COVID. Um, no or March, no March, March actually. In April. No March, March, April, he had COVID. Started. Yeah, and then um, he was cleared of it, him and my mother. My mother never got checked, but she was with him, so of course she has it. Um, and then... He was supposed to go to work, and he passed. Actually, supposed to wake up, and he didn't wake up. Your, your mom's good. Though. My uh, my mom was. What you mean? She passed too. No, 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 no. no. My mom is my mom is there, but my dad. They um. It wasn't. They didn't say it because it was COVID. Mm -hmm. They said it was more of a heart problem, but I feel like COVID kind of actually mm -hmm. increased. Added, it. added. Cause yeah. my, my mother passed the cold. Yeah, because it was and random. Asian, like yeah. it wasn't like I knew he was sick or had any mm -hmm. conditions. It was it out of nowhere. Yeah, it just happened. Yeah, damn. That's some peace. Yeah. I'm sorry to hear that. You know what I mean? Yeah. Do you, do you, do you, like, so now being that, how do they feel about you moving to New York? What do you mean? They, they, um, were, they, were they supportive they from, they, of your from transition? Yeah, I was too, right? Oh, um, like my parents with yeah. me coming. Um, I, again, I was already gone for a while. Like, I from high school, I never went back home. Like, 
in college, I after my I was going back to my sister's house, my mm-hmm. older sister, they had her own place. Um, and then after that, I was I went back to California. Then I moved to New York. I was never I never went back to my parents' house. So you're Native so. American. In black. Mm-hmm. In black. Okay. Oh, from Texas too. So. And then my they family's from Chicago. And stuff They're like from that Chicago. All right. Yeah. How was that? You ra- you was raised. I was Native raised American? in Texas though. On some na- on no, Native no, American no. times. Oh, no. uh, it was black times. Yeah, black. Okay, for sure. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah, buddy. You, you get the reparations, <laughs> like you know what I mean. Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> <laughs> but I was born in Cali, so we was we was there, and then. Oh, you were born in Cali. Mm-hmm. So you have some. Yo, I'm, so I'm some from everywhere. California. You're some rolling sixties. I'm from it, everywhere. <laughs> from everywhere. You was yeah. born in Cali. I was born. My family is from Chicago. Everyone, okay. mm-hmm. and then me and my younger brother was born in Cali, and then we moved to Texas. Sounds like a gang culture trait. Exactly, like a gang culture mm-hmm. trait. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Disciples. That's, you know what I mean? like, that's Disciples. how it goes. They went to Cali, then they moved and migrated to Texas. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Disciple star. <laughs> you know what I, mean? I don't that's know, but we appreciate you. You know, coming. Wait, through. hold on. Where can the people find you on the gram? What, what, what is your social media? What is going on? Like, you ain't giving nothing out. Nah, you it's, have a great no. personality. Do you so, want you a daycare mean? center? Like, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> like, you know, you're very open. That's, that's thank that's you. Dope. What is your no. sign or your Sagittarius? I am a Capricorn. Okay, I'm a Capricorn. My birthday is two days before Christmas. Okay. Oh, okay. Not getting no gifts. Mm-hmm. Okay. Star. What? Star. I get all the gifts. Oh, like, yeah, I, yeah. So, I already have my speech ready. Like, you can't fault me. <laughs> for my birthday, <laughs> being close to Christmas, get everyone separated. gets two. I get two. I get Christmas and birthday. Two and one. Okay, all right. Okay. Yeah, it's not fair. Okay. Yeah. What is your mm-hmm. What is your IG for the people that don't know? It's morning dot star six. Okay. All right. Okay. And we never tapped into all OnlyFans or nothing. We don't do that. Nah. We don't and do are you that. trying to tap into the OnlyFans? Being that no, the pandemic is. That. It's already been a year. I think I need to tap into OnlyFans. Nah. I mean, hey, if you surviving, surviving. Okay. How you survive? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? If you ain't got to tap into that, and you surviving. So, so, so do what all right, you before do. we wrap it up, what is Morningstar's future future plans? Yeah, what um, or if you if you doing day by day and you good bread and you like you know what. No, I actually I'm actually have two businesses going on that I haven't really brought to light as of yet. <laughs> okay. Um, I can tell you guys that off camera. Okay, 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 um, okay. But it is two big things that I am working on that oh, are starting to, to start. It's starting to go. Okay. Yeah, but um, putting my name on it, like as far as Morningstar and stuff like that, I'm not really. You want to be it's entrepreneur different. on the side? Yeah, it's two different. Okay. It's two different. With the government. Yeah, government yeah, because especially when people look at m- my image and you're looking at Instagram, they think it's totally you different. You feel you should separate that? You feel yeah, like this should yeah. Because like it's even I a lot of people. thinking like that too. Yeah. yeah, it's a lot of people that already think one way without even knowing me. Mm-hmm. Without even speaking to me, just hate you think you something right else. Away. I, I, I put so. you on a crazy pedestal this morning because my yeah. girl was like, yo, <laughs> you want some bacon? I was like, what? I'm like, I'll fuck with this bacon. It was veggie bacon. But you know what this shit said? It was morning star veggie yeah. bacon. <laughs> I swear to God, son. I was like, <laughs> it's going to be a good day. <laughs> I was like, no, but, but, but at first I was like, wait a minute. Let me see if this is how exactly this supposed to work. There's no way. That this shit yeah. says morning star. Bacon, yeah. right there. I swear oh, to God. And I'm going to send it to you. I was yeah. like, wow. All right, so that's what's that's up. That's what's up, man. What's we up? appreciate yeah. you coming through here. I have fun. Setting the tone. Now, I mean, you're always welcome to come back. You got something going on. Mm-hmm. Whatever. We open. You know what I mean? Um, once again, appreciate you for coming through. Morning star. Be the boy, Lynn Leasy. So, JC the Light. And this is Set the Tone Podcast. Thank oh. you. You're ready. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>